Oh, welcome back to the channel everyone. Today is an exciting day. The weather is lovely and we're going to go pick up a car. Uh, this is going to be my first ever little project car. Um, but I'm going half and half with Darren, um, as mentioned in the previous videos. Um, but yeah, it will be revealed in a minute what it is. Just going to pick Darren up and then go pick, we'll go have a look at the car. Pick it up, take it for a drive. Um, it's only two minutes away, so it's something we know. So. Eleven hundred pound in cash. Right, I've got the spare key. Darren has got the main key. But we are the owner of a track day car. Future track day car. Putting some petrol in. Because it was empty. Right, we got it. We've picked it up, it's right there, ticking over. Yes, we've got ourselves a Mark VI Fiesta ST facelift, ST150. It's got a few few mods on it already. It's got an um, exhaust system. Not sure what the exhaust system is, but it's got a four to one manifold, decat, um, and just a back box. So, it's got mansion induction kit, I believe. It's got some mansion stickers on it and, and I think it's blue chipped as well, or super chipped, tuned. Um, so yeah. Very excited, 1100 quid we paid for it all in, so looks good. Just driven it up here, both had a couple of goes each, and uh, for 1100 quid, it wasn't a bad little car. It's 122,000 miles it's done, so we're looking forward to getting into it and stripping it down. And uh, yeah, see where we go. So we just got it back after about an hour's driving around just getting a feel for it and see what it feels like as a, as a standard car. Um, very dirty so we're going to give it a clean. So a little blast that clean part was enough so we'll give it a once over with a couple of mitts and we'll see how it comes out. But it's not looking too shabby. Alright just have a quick look around. So we've got the induction kit that already come on the car whether that's a mountain one or not I don't know I'll have to do some digging into that. Down the back there we've got the 4 to 1 manifold which is absolutely roasting at the minute. We've got a nice little water breather. Um, but other than that, it looks pretty standard except for the super thin chip blue thin thing that come with it. Um, yeah, wheels have had a recent refurb I think. But the tyres on the front are alright, we've got some semi-slicks on the back that are low so they're going to get changed as soon as possible. Um, when driving at 30 mile an hour and up we've got a little bit of a whirring noise, it sounds like it's coming from this back, this back corner. Um, whether that's going to be the tyre or not or the wheel bearing so we'll find out when we get... Oh hello, I've just noticed we've got a puncher. So yeah, even more reason to get them wheels changed, the tyres changed over which Darren could be dead tomorrow. That's see whether that eliminate the, like the uh, the whirring noise, whether it's a step tight or a wheel bearing, we'll find out. So that's that. A um, little bit of a crunch going into second gear, so it seems to need a bit of a higher rev to stop it crunching. So, yeah, we'll see how we get on with it.
little spruce up, nice and clean all over. Found a couple of little no body work ain't even that bad really. Uh, so I think we've got a bit of a bargain with it, but we'll find out properly once we start taking things apart with the wheel, whether it's a tire or a wheel bearing. Um, it needs to be lowered desperately. That's going to be one of the first things to do because the it wasn't coilovers originally by the last owner. Click going for drive shafts because it was as low as it could go. So the wheels were up in the arches, static. Um, so he's put it back on, we think, standard Fiesta suspension, not ST suspension. So to come back here, it's very, very high. So we'll look for some coilovers on to get that sorted. Um, I think it could be holly bushed in certain areas as well. Need to get brake fluid changed because the brake fluid is black. Uh, and then, yeah, just an overall service, really. And then go from there and start stripping the interior out. And we shall see you on the next one. So stay tuned for track action now, I suppose, really.